Hey, it's Jennifer Sparks. It's winter 2024. Happy New Year. We are in Laughlin, Nevada, and today we're going to check out Harris. Harris in Laughlin is run by Caesars Entertainment as well as the Tropicana. We are currently driving from the Tropicana to Harris. According to Google Maps, the drive is three minutes away from one another and a 27 minute walk. There is also a shuttle bus that will take you from one property to the other. I was in town with my husband for two nights. It's our first time here and we're really excited to check out all of the resorts. Before our trip to Laughlin, we were staying in Las Vegas. We were there for five nights staying at Paris. We rented a car over at Harry Reid Airport from Dollar and we drove here. The drive here was awesome and took about an hour and a half, maybe closer to two hours. I just created a video about our rent-a-car experience, our drive here, and our stay at Tropicana. If you're interested in seeing any of those videos, I will leave them in a playlist at the end of this video. And here we are. This is my husband, Kelly, and we just arrived at Harrah's. And very unlike Las Vegas, everywhere we parked was free. And who doesn't like free parking? Come join us as we go explore Harris for the first time in Laughlin, Nevada. First impressions right off the bat as I'm walking around. Um, the architecture is very unique and Harris is very huge. We did not stay here. This is not going to be about the rooms. We're just going to do a walk around tour. I'm going to take you by the restaurants, by the pools. We're going to go through the casino. I'm going to do the best I can to capture the essence of Harris. I have no idea at this point what the filming policies are in any of the casinos in Laughlin. I'm gonna do the best I can. I usually find out by getting a tap on the shoulder or sometimes even getting screamed at. <laughs> it's all part of the gig. I don't know. I kind of feel like I'm doing them a favor by giving them free advertising. We are visiting very early in the morning. This is probably about eight, nine o'clock in the morning and there is really nobody here. This video was filmed the day before Christmas Eve, so it's December 23rd. On this date in Las Vegas, they were hosting at Caesars Properties five times rewards or tier points, something like that. But I think that really affected the attendance at the Caesars Properties in Laughlin. Okay, now I have to ask, can you guys hear me? How does my voice sound? I have a sinus infection. I don't know if it's because I can't hear well or if my voice isn't portraying as strongly as it usually is. I had gotten some feedback that people can't hear me, but I haven't changed any of my volume, so I'm kind of confused. I have no time to be sick. I have so many reviews to make. If you're new to my channel, this is what I do. I travel and I go to resorts and I take the tour and I film it and I tell people what it's like. So you as a traveler can make better decisions about your upcoming trips. If you like videos like this and you like casinos and you want to go to Laughlin or Las Vegas, you might want to consider subscribing to my channel because I have a lot of useful information for you. Let's start by talking about Harris Dining. They have a smash burger that we just saw and they also have a pin of pizza. They have these in Vegas and the lines are always super long. For quick serve dining, they also have the red mango and Cinnabon as well. Compared to the Tropicana in town, I would have to say, I'd have to give it to Harris for better dining. They also have some more upscale dining options here as well. They have an arcade here and I'm gonna see if I could get on the elevator and take you to a floor. Maybe we could peek in a room. The only things I know about this resort is that it was a little more expensive to stay here than Tropicana at the time of my booking. There are two towers, I believe, and I believe they allow pets, but there's a certain pet stay room that you have to call and ask for. And there is an extra charge for pets. I was hoping to get a peek in one of the rooms. Sometimes you could get a peek if there's a housekeeper cleaning, but that wasn't the case on this day. But we are gonna go outside and check out the outside facilities. Structurally, Harris is very impressive, very dynamic, but it's got its boo-boos. <laughs> it's not perfect. I love the patios. Um, the outside area would be the the biggest difference between Harrah's and Tropicana. It has two large pools, cabanas, it's on the water, it has a beach, it's very impressive. Had I been visiting here in the warmer season, I probably would have picked Harrah's over Tropicana just for the outside facilities. Being on the river and having the beach and all the activities is definitely an added plus, even if it was a little bit extra money. Staying at one of the Caesars properties was definitely a priority for me because I'm a Caesars Rewards member. What does that mean? It means I signed up for the card and when I gamble, I put my card in the machine. And when I do that, I get points and the points gives me discounted or comp rooms. 
It's great, right? Well, this was a weekend. I didn't get comp rooms at any of these two places, but I was able to get rooms cheaper here than anywhere else in this area. Other resorts that I was considering staying were the Golden Nugget, Aquarius, and Edgewater. I will be showing you videos throughout the week, maybe next week, <laughs> whenever I get them out of these other properties as well, and our walk around tours over there. So many great resorts to stay in, so little time. Where do you like to stay when you go to Laughlin, Nevada? Let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear from you. One thing that I did love and dislike at the same time about Harrah's is where it was located. It was down on the end, so you're really not right next to anything else. But that is a wonderful thing too, because it really kind of just felt, felt very quiet. I'm sure it gets hopping in the summer. Um, for Las Vegas, this would be comparable to like, say, Mandalay Bay. Mandalay Bay is a great resort. It's just not close to anything. Or in Atlantic City, like Tropicana. You know how it's like kind of its own little thing? I'm not comparing Harris to Mandalay Bay or Tropicana. I'm just using it as a reference to like how it's a little on the outskirts of all the action. We didn't gamble here at all. We just like seriously were here maybe less than an hour probably. We didn't even eat here either. We have a lot of resorts to see today. The next place we went was golden nugget and we ended up having breakfast there look out for that video coming up in the near future i may do that one next the laughlin was awesome it was finally great to see it i've been wanting to come here for so long bucket list checked off <laughs> but i would like to come here again and actually get a room in each place and make a more accurate video about each place it's very unfair for me to give it like you know a whole review of a place i only spent like an hour in and this is about when we got stopped <laughs> for filming. They said, no filming in here. And I was like, oh, shoot, I didn't know. I'm so sorry. The security guard couldn't have been sweeter, though. He was so cool. Should you come to Laughlin? I don't know. I mean, it's not nearly as exciting as Las Vegas. Las Vegas, everywhere you look, there's just something crazy going on. This is definitely more low key so much easier to figure out and navigate. Here are some more places that you could dine while at Harris. There's also a steakhouse here. I'm not sure if I saw it or not, um, if you're looking for more of a fine dining type of experience. And let's not forget the cake vending machines. They have all these all over Vegas. <laughs> They're pretty good too. Me and my husband Kelly would like to thank you for taking the tour with us at Harris Las Vegas. We are on our way right now to go to Golden Nugget and get him some breakfast. He gets really hangry if I don't feed him on time. Look out for more of our tours of Laughlin, Nevada. Thank you so much for hanging with us. This is your host and your tour guide, Jennifer Sparks. Check out our playlist right over here of other tours about Laughlin and Las Vegas. Whatever you do, just make sure you book that trip, pack your bags and go. Safe travels to you and good luck in the casinos.